Ken and Bob. Okay, we'll take, we'll take the bus. And now, back to Ken, and you guessed it, Bob! <laughs> Here's Ken, and oh, wow, look who's right behind him. Bob! <laughs> Is that Bob and Ken coming down the road? You bet. Here's Bob and Ken now. Wow. They're frying something in that pan. It's right on camera. KABC Talk Radio time is 10.47. If you love appreciating or admiring art, especially Native American Indian art, then do stop by the National Heritage Gallery of Fine Art. They're um, on Rodeo Drive, North Rodeo Drive, 315 North uh -huh. Rodeo between Chanel and Me? Gucci. Me? The National <laughs> Heritage <laughs> Gallery. Very proud to exhibit the, the rarity of quality, the length of time to complete each work is never been a factor. If you have happened to walk by the gallery, yeah, you may have noticed their in-house sculptors, Delespri. Delespri does beautiful work, a traditional place, sculptors of Western Indian and Art Nouveau. But you might already know her by her most recent commission of Gene Autry and his horse champion on oh, permanent display wonderful. at the Gene Autry Western Heritage Museum. The National Heritage Gallery, 315 North Rodeo Drive. If you have any inquiries, give them a call, 278-0530. Gina's the one with the walker, I think. Build this Who? No, wrong number. 3391, but you got the wrong number. Thank you for the scheduled customer seminar. Comparable House of Imports at 213 or 7. I'm just a sweet trans. Don't forget to get to line five. Oh, you mean line three with the mu music? Oh! Yeah, I've got her. I've got her. Uh, Fran? Yeah. Stand by, stand by. Now, you got a piece of music? I have a sheet music, yes. Yeah. <laughs> For me and my gal? Hi, Mary. Okay, stay with me. How old? I'm 13. Yes, ma'am. Marita, get ready. Uh, say hi from my sister Melissa, who's in school, and she's really in love with Oh, that's yeah. nice. What time is uh, Vader coming on? Uh, uh, 12. Uh, Thank you. So she's in classes this morning and she can't call? No, yeah. <laughs> Tell her I got the message. Okay. <laughs> Meet you in the parking lot, the usual <laughs> way. Marita. Yes. Good morning. Good morning. Tim, Hello. this is Marita, your ex-roommate from Central Park West. Oh, that's amazing. Hi. <laughs> yeah. How are you? Now, is this something, I mean... <laughs> um, Tim was doing it's... travesties on Broadway oh, oh, that's true. 10 years ago, and that's right. he sublet my aunt Joan's uh, apartment that I was living in. <laughs> that's fantastic. And we, there were two cats. So, oh, yes. Um, what were they called? Uh, Chips? And pumpernickel. Pumpernickel, yeah. <laughs> Um, that was a great apartment, too. I know. It was Jane Hackett's apartment. Yes. Ah, and I was doing a uh, Tom Stoppard play called Travesties. Ah. You, you really worked with some great... Uh, you worked the works of some great, great writers. P I, I, Peter Schaffer, Tom Stoppard. Um, I've done three, three plays of, of Tom's. If my name was Stoppard and I said I have a play, would your answer be before you heard anything yes. about it? <laughs> <laughs> Timing is everything. Absolutely. <laughs> it would uh, be. Marita, did he pay the, the rent? Did he pay the rent? Oh, yeah, yes. I sure did. Actually, I remember something very nice that Tom Stoppard did when he came to see me. Hold on, I can't. I'm in a payphone booth because I heard you on the radio and I thought, oh, what the heck? What the heck? Well, Tom Stoppard came to visit me at at um, at your apartment, and he looked through the bookshelves as he, as you know writers tend tend to do, and found um, a copy of Jumpers, his play, yes. on, on Joan's shelves, and took it out and wrote inside it to Joan with love from Tom, uh, and. And I said, should I tell her that you've done that? And he said, no, no, I, <laughs> I wanted to find it as a surprise. Of course you won't believe I thought it. that was such a wonderful thing to do. Oh, I remember um, one night he met me, and then the next day he met me and said, hello, how are you? And I said, you've never met me. Now, you're a publicist. Right. Most well, of my I, audience... I'm a retired. No, 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 I've just brought you back to life. Uh, most people have, have never seen the Rocky Horror Show uh, in a mass yeah, audience. By briefest description, no, could I or both of you tell me what the heck it was all about? I and I saw it twice. <laughs> I'm still trying to work it out. I saw it a million times, and, and each time there was something new that I saw in it. Uh, it, it, it was a pretty wild show. I, I don't know. Tim, how would you describe it? Well, I think, you know, it was a, a mix of a lot of things that, 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 that were just... Um, part of that gender. Yes. Well, I mean, uh, horror comics, 
um, yeah, my saw it in uh, well. horror movies, uh, particularly B movies, no, the movie, um, and kind of glitter rock, which was happening at the time. It was actually it was a sort of a joke. Years. Yeah, it was okay. a satire. With that in mind, you were the transvestite. I was. Ah. At such strenuous living, I just don't understand when it's just seven days. Oh, baby, I can make you a man. Do those words sound familiar, Shirley? Oh, do they ever, and were they great. I'll tell you, it was really, you know, having um, only handled very conservative things, and then to go into this whole rock thing was such a shock. <laughs> but it was so wonderful because it was a great cast, and Tim was marvelous, and, and they were all so cooperative. It was a real joy. Well, I'm glad, and it's very nice to hear you. And I've got to get in to see you in, in your show. Because, oh, please do. Um, and, and I would love to see you, so if I do get in, I will certainly come back to at least say hello and give you a hug. You bet. Yes, please. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. You've had an hour of hugs. Isn't that enough? I know. Well, I've been watching you on stage. Thank you for joining us, Tim. Thank you very much, Mike. There were women who loved their men so much. They happily only oh, oh, love them. Come on, I'm possibly. If February 13th, do they have a little bit of tradition? I'm sorry, it's tough, but we'll see what happens. Say hi to the folks. Here's the piece of sheet, and that's your thing. Okay, thank you. Thanks for what? Is she, wa is she sending it to me? She wants us to call them. Yeah, they both tried. Yes. Or there was some information that came yesterday after the invite to the show. Just some articles on drug yeah. testing and uh, very warm up. Recent stuff. Okay. Okay. Wonderful. Good. Great response. Good. Thank you so much. Well, sir, so 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 right. No problem. I, I'm going to preserve it for history. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and being chased by posterity. <laughs> you want to leave or you want um, to uh, stay? No, I ought to, Bathroom? I ought to leave. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Actually, since you ask, yeah. Yeah, okay, you either, yeah right, right around this corner here. Can I follow you in? <laughs> <laughs> and keep going. Uh huh. To your left. Uh huh. Towards the light. <laughs> <laughs> on action, wait a minute, on action, and action! Mr. Curry! <laughs> no pictures. <laughs> no pictures. So oh, my I'm name sorry, is Trina, sorry. I work over at KLOS. Oh. I just wanted to say hi. Oh, I'm a big oh. fan. Well, thank I've you. seen Rocky Horror millions of times. Yeah, I mean, it's great. Yeah, it's very nice. Thank yeah. you very much. You're welcome. Was it fun? Yeah, it was. Yeah. Was. yeah. Um, Particularly the ads. Why don't you... Um, yeah. You don't have to do that much. We'll go back or I'll write down my handbook and I'll call you. Which way do you want to go out? Oh, it's taking this way because Norma's got to go back this way. I just want to, just okay. so I can check the locations. If I we may be tight on seats, and I don't want Michael to sit. Well, if not, they can come, come next week. Yeah, so we'll, we'll make arrangements whenever. But um, let me double check with you before we confirm with Michael. So if I can call you back and you know. And to the door to the right. You go out the door and says you can't. Tim, You'll love this part. I'm gonna get my things. Okay. I appreciate it. I'll well, see you later. Up and down the hall. Thank you. Thank you. Um. Hey, thank you. Thank you. Thanks for being a good sport. Bye, guys. Memo to these from his friend Robert Wallace. Daily supermarket, you know, a few well, stores is doing it, but not safe.